Hey, August Block here again. So I'm all packed up, ready to go, ready to fly to Paris. Uh, feeling the relief of like leave, like taking my work and everything else off my mind and just letting myself be on this trip. Uh, it takes, there's like a little bit of a crunch time at the end there where you're like going over your checklist and you're setting things up and did you train enough? Do you have everything? Like, but now I'm like all packed up. Things are in the boxes. There's nothing else I can do at work. Family's taken care of. You know, it's time to just say like, flip that switch and say, I'm going to Paris. Really excited about it. And I know that the first 20 or 25 hours of this adventure is gonna be just fantastic. Cause that's about when the pain sets in. After that, it's gonna be a mixed bag, I'm sure. Uh, but now I'm just sitting here enjoying a nice latte and waiting for my Uber. Let's get this show on the road. through customs. Time to collect my bike. I don't know if you can see the dashboard on this car. It's kind of hokey. I mean, it's got the Star Trek look to it, but it's totally unnecessary. So if you don't know where Rambouillet is, Rambouillet is just like a small suburb of Paris to the south. It takes about an hour and a half to get there by car. Well, at least today it did. I think I remember the same when I took a taxi uh, last time. But it, it goes from this very congested area to like open fields and then into like a little like village type environment. So I'll, I'll show some footage of that coming up. Hey, boy, it's warm here. It's just great. You know, I, I looked at the weather. I'm probably not gonna need any of my foul weather gear. I mean, I'll, I'll bring a base layer and some light gloves and, uh, and a raincoat, but looking at the forecast, if it's gonna be accurate, that's really gonna lighten my load. Last time I was here, it got freezing cold, rain. Um, I'm, I'm hoping that it doesn't do that, but it uh, looks like I mean, we're barely gonna have any cloud cover. So that's great. Anyway, I'm going to go to the catacombs tonight and meet some friends, as I mentioned, on the way in. Uh, but I, I really want to make some headway getting my bike set up because I just need to get in front of it. You, you never know. If I run into any kind of you know, complications, a missing part, I got to be able to get out there and source it and fix it and have plenty of time to do that. So I'm going to try to just jump on putting my bike together right now.
All right, so I got the bike together. Now I'm just gonna go give it a quick test ride, ride down to the starting line, check out the whole scene, check out the lay of the land, you know, um, maybe bump into some other riders, uh, just check the whole town out and grab something to eat. So actually being here is so exciting. I'm riding through the starting area, the whole town is like full of bikes, people everywhere. It's, it's kind of like calm and a little bit electric at the same time. So I'm here at the uh, the bike corral for the pickup package pickup. Uh, I was really just going to do a shakeout ride, but I got here. It was so exciting, and then I rode by some guy said, "I saw your video yesterday. That was really pretty awesome." So I'm just going to go in here and see if I can't get my number and my packet and everything, and uh, yeah, set my bike up. All right, so I picked up my packet. I got the sign. <laughs> they give you an arrow, so you probably some people won't steal the arrows there on the route before the race is over, before the ride's over, and people get lost in my packet, which is my jersey and brevet card and everything I'm going to need for the ride. Now, uh, if they're still doing an inspection, I'll go ahead and put my placard on. Otherwise, I'll just lay it out at the hotel and get it set up there. This is getting charged up fun. Hey, so I just ran into one of my subscribers and I, he, he flagged me down at the starting point here uh, the day before the registration. I heard someone calling out my name and uh, it was uh, Jez. Uh, and he brought me the most fantastic little gift. He brought this killer little bell. Like you must have seen the walkthrough on my bike and it's like, this is gonna go. So he, he, he gifted this to me it's, and, he, and he, he wrote on it. So it's, uh, you know, good luck, PVP 2023. So nice, thank you so much, Jez. Really appreciate it. It was great seeing you. I'll see you on the road. Uh, Romania, yes, it's a Romanian from Romanian from Yeah, Pittsburgh. nice to meet you. Oh, and you. we are Romanian, Did you, Romanian from Romania. Arad, Arad, and Romania Timisora. from Arad. Oh, okay, okay. And Timisoara. Okay, so why are you doing Romania? this? I'm sorry? Why are you doing this? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Because we can. Yeah. Are you around the north? Come on, come on, come yeah. on. Are you doing it? We have a girl. Yeah. Have we have a girl. All right. From Timisoara. You're from, from, from Romania as well? Yeah. Yes. Okay. And two guys also from Timisoara. All right. Is this the first time you've done this? Uh, no. It's for for most, of, most of us, uh, it's second time. Okay. 